Okay, so I'm gonna explain it. It's just a tad bit. Okay, so it says to be a man is to have dominion over your existence and to lead your existence. Okay, so the first part having dominion over your existence, meaning taking full fucking responsibility and accountability of your entire life. Basically, no codependent. Okay. Um, and, and some people might be like, oh, well, I already do that, and I pay for this, I pay for that. It's not about that. It's about truly, really having that dominion over your existence. Basically, no one can control you. No one can control your thought process but you. Straight up. Literally. Like, seriously, having that much control over your peace. Basically, having a peace of mind. A true peace of mind. Not one that seems like, oh, it just sounds good to say that you have a peace of mind. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to give you an example about the peace of mind. Someone can possibly verbally disrespect me and call me a bitch and I laugh at them. Why? Because it's unbothering to me. I'm unbothered by it. And two, (laughs) you did not control my mind and have me come out of character to fuck you up. See? I have dominion over that. You can, people can say all type of fighting words and it will not hurt me. At all. I'm like, it's like, I be cracking the fuck up at people. It'd be so, it'd be so funny. I'd be, they be, and people be getting mad too. They'd be like, damn, I just call, I'm like, I know, but let me call you that now. So it's my turn, right? Tag, I'm it, right? Let me call you that. And I guarantee you're going to jump out of character and try to physically harm me. And you're putting your life and everything you gain at risk. Now you're, now you're giving up what you've gained at risk. Like, seriously. And if you feel like you tangibly don't have nothing, you will lose everything, your entire fucking freedom. And people are willing to risk that. Like, someone's going to come to their fucking aid. But when you are going from a prince to a king to a god, you move so much differently in each phase. You know what I'm saying? So having dominion, having that control over your mental, emotion, and your physical existence is so key it's 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 so golden like that is super number one and and having dominion with your peace of mind having a true peace of mind because when you have a true peace of mind you're unbothered no one can bring you out of character at all only you can bring you out of character that's how much control way much more control you have now the second part to lead your existence that means to really boss the fuck up and be a leader in your life be the best example be the man be the person that you wish somebody was to you but be that for you be that for your now self your future self and appreciate your past self it's time to elevate this is what this whole entire statement truly means that's what this means to lead your existence you are a fucking leader Don't look for no other fucking leadership outside of you unless you feel like you need guidance because you feel like you cannot control yourself and you feel like you can't control your life. So needing guidance, you know what I'm saying, to be able to put you back on track. However, you have to make it up in your mind that you are more mature enough to be able to control and guide your own life, your own existence. If you cannot do that, someone will do it for you and you will be under their control, meaning you will be a slave. So with this saying, what of what I'm saying is basically be your master of yourself. Don't be a fucking slave for no one and nothing. Straight up. Or or you do have a choice. You can be a slave. (laughs) So choose very, very, and I mean very wisely very wisely because your life literally depends upon it it depends upon whether you're going to be a slave for the next hundred years or 10 years or next month or next year or you're going to be a master of entire your your entire rest of your life master yourself you master your entire fucking life straight up straight up and it has nothing to do with perfection it has everything to do with how you view life Seriously, if you view it from a victim mindset, guess what? You're going to continue to be a fucking slave and a victim, straight up. You're going to be a slave to anything and anyone. It can be fucking drugs, 
alcohol, uh, any fucking thing you're going to be a slave to. And, and people and love and girls and all type of shit and jobs, all that shit. And when you are a slave to something and someone, you cannot fucking complain on how they treat you. You can't. Why? Because you're a fucking slave. Now, when you boss up and you decide you're not going to fucking take that bullshit, guess what happens? Then you become more of a master. You start to learn like you got like you start to take the power back. You have to realize you have fucking power. You have power. Literally. You owe it to yourself to operate in your power come 2023. If not, you're going to repeat every fucking thing you did this year. Every fucking thing. Good, bad, and ugly. Now, it's up to you to make those decisions. So, I say all this to say this. Namaste. Ashe, ashe. I love you and I send you this stuff because I actually want you to do fucking great in your life. Straight up. If I didn't fucking care, I wouldn't send you this shit. I'm just being honest. (laughs) Seriously. Continue on your journey.